Hello there guys, my name is Curtis Shadog, it's the ball bot built for theme park news and welcome to a theme park news update from Legoland Winter. Now before we get started, make sure you like, comment, subscribe and click the notification bell so you never miss a YouTube video. And for now, let's zoom into the video. So this is from Legoland Windsor. This is on their uh, Brick Week 2020. Now if you have no idea what this is, basically uh, Brick Week is their February half term event. It runs from the 15th all the way to the 23rd of February. It runs the attractions from 10 a.m. till 4 p.m. Uh, so very good opening times for a February half term event. Now, of course, first of all, before we go on about the confirmed rides in the lineup, I do have to say that I'm really good and about this. I feel like Legoland Windsor are going to do a really good job with this. I feel like uh, the ride lineup's pretty good. I feel like with the park growing in the next couple of years, with the Duplo Dream Coaster coming next year, and of course uh, the Lego Movie World plan for 2021. So. Uh, I feel like we've got um, a good, it's a good time to do a February half term event because the park's in its new growing stage over the next couple of years. So I feel like uh, the park's going to be at a good stage next year in the next couple of years. So I feel that's a good move to do it now rather than later. Uh, so let's get on about the ride lineup then for February half term 2020. So the ride lineup, the February half term ride lineup for Legoland Winter confirms as follows Legoland Express. Haunted House Monster Party, Lego City Driving Schools, L Drivers, Balloon School, uh, Fire Academy, Mia's Riding Adventure, Laser Raiders, Scarab Bouncers, Thunder Blazer, Desert Chase, Aero Nomad, The Hill Train, uh, we also have Lego Studio 4D, Destiny's Bounty, Jolly Roger, Dragon's Apprentice, The Dragon, and Spinning Spider. So very good. And very neat ride selection there. I feel like the whole Egyptian area will be cool. It's nice to see this year's new attraction, the Haunted House Monster Party, come into the ride lineup. I feel that's a pretty strong move for the park. And I feel like uh, there's a pretty good selection of rides. It's not just like a certain number of family attractions and a couple of thrill rides and stuff like that. It's a good mixture of family, thrill, coaster. Um, it's a good mixture. Uh, and like I said, I think this February half term event is going to grow over the next few years, especially with the developments going on in the future of the park, especially with the likes of uh, the Duplo Dream Coaster next year, the Lego Movie World in 2021, whatever they've got planned for 2022 and onwards from there. So I feel like this event's going to grow over the next few years, and I feel like this event's going to grow and become one of the best February half term events for theme parks in the UK. So overall, I'm pretty happy with that. I think my favourite attraction on there is going to be Haunted House Monster Party. Uh, you can't see it behind me, but last night I was actually looking through some of my old park photos and I found an old photo from the Jungle Coaster in 2006 when I was six years old. Can you imagine how cute? If you follow me on Instagram, you'll have seen the picture. Um, I was so called me in yellow, basically, so um, stick with the Legoland brand. But no, I, 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 just, I found that photo um, and it was just like, it was like a, like, a, like a dream to see one of my old photos, so um, really cool there. Uh, but for now guys, thank you very, very much for watching this theme park newsroom update. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe, and click the notification bell so you never miss a YouTube video. And for now guys, my name is Coach Chow, keep on the Coast Life, and I'll see you guys in the next video very, very soon. Take care, have an awesome day my friends.